This video is going to demonstrate the text flow items that are within the paragraph dialog box. I'm using Word 2010 for the demonstration, although these, these features would be uh, in any version of Word, uh, former or, or later versions. In this situation, notice that I have the title here at the bottom of this page and the paragraph that it references on the next page. The way many users alleviate this problem is they simply click in front of the title and they put a hard page break or a control enter into their document. Now, at first glance, you feel like this fixed the problem. However, a hard page break means that we want the page to break there no matter what. Later, if we were to remove the previous paragraph from the dialog from the document, the paragraphs on the next page will not flow back to the previous page, even though there's plenty of room for them now, because a hard page break was put into the document. Again, a hard page break means we want the, do the page to break here no matter what. I'm going to go ahead and undo that to take us back to where we started. What should have happened instead is simply clicking in this title paragraph anywhere, opening the paragraph dialog box, and in the back of the of the dialog box on the line and page breaks, simply check Keep With Next. What you're saying then is that you want this paragraph to be on the same page as the next paragraph. Once I click OK, you'll notice immediately that the title went to the next page. But if I remove this paragraph, notice that it flows back up. That's because I didn't say that I wanted it definitely to break here. What I said is I want this paragraph to be on the same page as the next paragraph. Here's another situation. In this case I have three bulleted items. These two bulleted items are at the bottom of one page and this one's at the top of the next. And I want the three bulleted items to be on the same page. So if I select these two items and I go into my paragraph dialog box and keep with next. Because I'm telling it this paragraph needs to be on the same page as the next one and this paragraph needs to be on the same page as the next one, notice that the three items are together. Later, if things were, if data was removed, that they all three could flow back, they would. But what I'm saying is that I always want these three, uh, these three paragraphs to be on the same page. So it's in these text flow area, the keep with next, and sometimes the keep lines together that you want to use in order to control your page breaks within paragraphs.